Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I thought it would be fun to share some stocking stuffer ideas with you. This is seriously the hardest thing for me during the holidays is coming up with what to put in my family's stocking. So let's get into it. First, I will go over what I am putting in my husband's stocking to give you guys some ideas of what to do for the men in your life because let's be honest, if they want something, they Amazon Prime it. They're impossible. I don't know what to get in. So, first, body wash. Who doesn't need body wash? I hate wasting money and just stuffing stockings with things that they're never going to use. That includes my kids. So I try to get as many practical, usable things as I can. So this is just the Old Spice Hydro Wash. It smells like a man. It smells good. So some good old body wash. They're going to use it. Fills up some space in the bottom of the stocking. So that's a good one. Gum. Who doesn't like gum, right? It's better than candy. Some hair product. This is my husband's tried and true product, so I'll usually pick him up a couple of these and put them in his stocking and he can just use them for a few months and I won't have to go and get him more for a while. So hair product. Skin care. Most guys, or maybe I'm wrong, a lot of guys might like skin care. So I'm trying to get my husband to start washing his face. So, I'm going to stick some skincare in his stocking. Sunglasses. This is kind of a bigger purchase. We have really good vision insurance, so it's not as big of a deal, but sunglasses can be a really good kind of like up at the top of the stocking um, to get them excited about what's inside. But I feel like sunglasses are appropriate for a stocking. A tie um, is always a needed item. They can wear it to church or anything that needs some dressing up. So I will usually pick up one or two ties for my husband for his stocking for Christmas. This one is on my husband's list, cologne. This is not the one I'll be giving him for Christmas. I have to go pick that out still. But you can do a large cologne or a small. Either would fit perfectly in a stocking. And this is something obviously they're going to use almost every day. So cologne is a good one. A speaker of some sort, whether it's headphones. This one connects to a phone and he can listen to music or a podcast while he's in the shower. Um, that's kind of what this one's for. It's waterproof. It's like a shower speaker. So I think that he will really like this one. I'll try and link some of the things um, in the description box um, to help you guys find them if they're what you're looking for. So I'll always stick a bag of his favorite candy, which is Sour Skittles. He doesn't love some candy, right? I've I found this in the Target dollar spot for a dollar. It's putty so the kids can play with it, but it's coal, which I thought was funny. I'm actually going to put this on top that he's getting coal for Christmas, so just kind of a joke, but I thought it was cute. My kids won't understand it, so I'm putting it in my husband's stocking. Um, the last thing, if you haven't heard of Stance socks, they're really, really nice quality socks. You can find them at Nordstrom, usually boutiques and things like that. Um, I picked these ones up at Nordstrom, but um, I just picked them up a couple pairs of Stance socks. They're good for church or in the winter for work um, with his dress shoes just to keep their feet warm. Um, but you can get them in basically every pattern. They have a whole bunch of Star Wars ones. Just anything you can imagine, but they're really nice quality socks. So stance, I will link those down below. So that is what I will be putting in my husband's stocking. Hopefully that gives you guys some good ideas, but let's get into what I'm going to be putting in my three-year-old boy's stocking. Okay, so this is his stocking, little Santa Claus. I picked this up at Gordman's a couple of years ago and he loves it, so it works. So 
So I'm just going to be giving him a little pair of cute Rudolph socks that I found at the Target Dollar Spot. These were a dollar, so he'll be excited and they're usable throughout the year. This was also from the Target Dollar Spot. It's that sculpt foam that they can kind of like squish. Obviously this is more of something they're just going to use and then probably throw it away. But it was a dollar, so if it only entertains on Christmas Day, I'm fine with that. So just a little kind of space filler there. So these I thought were really cool. My kids absolutely love the bath. So I wanted to get something bath time related. And these are crayons that they can color on the sides of the tub and it just washes right off. So genius. They will love this, both of my kids. But I just got one they can share in the tub. Um, I think this was like $4.99 or something at Target. So I will try and link that for you guys as well. These were Target Dollar Spot. He will love these. He loves cars, police car, and a digger. So that pretty much sums up my three-year-old in two words. Um, these were a dollar a piece, so he'll be excited to play with those on his car mat. These he might not be quite as excited for, but they're training underwear. We are trying our best to get him potty trained. So these are just kind of in need but they're good for his stocking. Um, they might excite him. We're trying to get him excited for potty training. So these ones are just white, but he also has some Mickey ones. Gold coins. These were in the Target dollar spot for a dollar. He is in love with these things. He thinks they're so cool. He thinks they're real gold, um, but obviously when he's done playing with them, he can eat them. So. Um, I just picked these up because he really likes them, thinks they're cool. So this is kind of random, um, these are golf tees. I saw the cutest little game at this toddler gym that I send him to where you stick the golf tees into a cardboard box and you let them hammer them down in. And my three-year-old is obsessed with hammering and just tools in general. So I got him these wooden golf tees and I'm just going to have a little cardboard box set up that he can hammer them into and he will be so excited because he played this and he's been asking to do it at home ever since. So this was kind of random but something I know that he will be really excited about. And just a fun, free, almost free, that these were $2, idea to entertain your toddler for endless amount of time. So the last person that I will be sharing stocking ideas for is my one-year-old baby. So he, I don't know, babies are hard because they don't really care, but I wanted to do something for him. Um, this isn't a permanent stocking, but it's just a cute one I found in the Target dollar spot for $3 that we're going to use this year for him. It's like a smaller one, but it's so soft and cute. Um, but I am going to be sticking a spinning toothbrush. He's started to get teeth and absolutely loves my spinning toothbrush and his brother's. So I know <laughs> this will probably be the favorite thing that he gets for Christmas. Um, he just loves to brush his own teeth and he loves the vibration of it. I think it probably feels good on his teething gums. So these were like $4 at Target. So that will take up a big amount of his stocking. These I found in the Target Dollar Spot for three dollars. They're little magnets. They're big, actually, so they they're not a choking hazard. But he can stick them on the fridge. Um, my sister-in-law had them at her house, and he loved them. He played with them the entire time we were there, just sticking them and unsticking them from the fridge. So I thought that he would be excited to have his own to play with on the fridge. So that one will be a fun stocking stuffer for the one-year-old. I also got him one of the Target Dollar Spot cars for a dollar. This one has Santa on it. I picked him up some socks for a dollar. These ones have Frosty the Snowman. And lastly, I picked him up this super cute little toy. This is by Baby Einstein. I got it at Target. When you shake it, it lights up and plays music. And it's just really interactive. It has these little 
dangly, tassely things for them to play with. And this is kind of like gummy, so they can chew on it for their teeth. Um, but this was just really cute and I had to have it. So that will be my one-year-old stocking. If you guys need more ideas, let me know. I am full of them for women as well, but I don't really have a woman to do stocking for. So this is what I would suggest for a husband, a toddler, and a baby. So leave some comments down below. Let me know what you are going to be putting in your significant other or children's stockings to give me some more ideas. I will link everything that I possibly can for you guys. And thanks for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe this video. Bye.